Hello everyone, good morning. Well, it's not morning, I'm a liar. I always say good morning when I start a vlog, and it's not morning, it is 12.30, and I'm making some lunch. And I thought I'd go ahead and vlog today. I vlogged yesterday, <laughs> um, and I thought I would just continue today because in the last vlog at the end, I was talking about how today I'm going to um, this like skin office and I'm talking thinking about getting a chemical peel for the last little bit of my scars here because none of this is active acne this all these spots are scarring and um, I've done pretty much all I can on my own for my scars so I figured it was time to look into that and I'm also thinking about getting off of my acne medication oh my god look at these little plates with lemons they were on sale at Target because you know no one wants to spend five dollars for paper plates so they were on sale so I really some, someone said I need to get like um, a permanent tripod for the kitchen because I never know where to put you guys and that is so damn true girl so damn true so um, I'm thinking about getting a laser chemical peel or whatever um, I'm going there today for a consultation and we're gonna just talk about some options I'm thinking about getting off of my medication I also wanted to get laser hair removal um, on my upper lip because as like a makeup person i always feel like my makeup looks really um like it, it enhances your mustache and i've been taking off my upper lip hair for years with like the nair face remover i can't talk today and uh i don't know i would love for it just to be <laughs> gone so uh i don't think i can do that on my medication we have to talk about it so i thought i'd bring you guys today to the consultation i'll let you guys know what they say my skin is so like so much better than years ago i'm not gonna lie to you i'm scared to get off of my doxycycline um, but I know you shouldn't be on it for too long. I've been on it for a couple of years now and I would love to not have to be on medication anymore. But like, I watch old videos and my skin was just covered in acne and I just don't want to go back there. Um, and before that I had tried so many remedies, so many natural remedies. I would prefer to go the natural route. But the girl I spoke to on the phone at the place that I'm going today told me that some people got off of their medication and they started doing um, chemical peels. I don't know if that's the right word, some sort of peel regularly and um, their acne never came back and their skin improved so much more than with the medicine. So I would love if that happened. I would really prefer to not have to be on medication. We'll see how today goes. So I'm in my little choice of on shirt. Um, I just woke up and took a walk this morning with my mom and I've been editing and I had um, some phone calls today. So just been getting some work done. <laughs> and for lunch, I am just I'm making a tuna melt with some smart food. So and I'm also watching Bay tell her story time on the birthday drum. We just had a, like a very like little lunch dunch snack. Yeah. Hi. Um, well, we had like a funny story to tell you. Oh, that one. Yeah. Are you gonna tell them about the psychologist and the yeah. psychiatrist? Yeah. So I'm watching Marriage. Thank you. Day, guys. You Thank too. You. All right, you can tell them while I. Okay, so I'm watching Marriage Boot Camp reality and. The psychologists and the psychiatrists were talking to all the people there, the couples. It's a crazy fact. Go take it. There, I have to take it. So my whole face is on camera. Hi, is this my good side? <laughs> so anyway, the one of the doctors, the male, was questioning the people there. Um, it's a bunch of couples for counseling. And asked the question, how long do you think it takes a woman to get over a breakup? And guess what the answer was? Al? What was the answer? My guess was six months and it was three months. The answer was three months. Then she asked me. Then I asked her, well, how long do you think it takes a man to get over a breakup? And she said. My guess was a week. <laughs> and the answer was. A week. We're all set. Oh, thank you. Thank the answer you so was actually nine months. No kidding. Yeah, so what's going on with that? And it was funny because the reason was biological in addition to situational, which I thought was really crazy. So 
even though they seem like they don't give a F. They give an F more than we do. Right? Isn't that crazy? Which it's kind of it's kind of nice to know that they're suffering that yeah. long. <laughs> That. Um, and I'll okay. You're like holding the camera so perfect. So I'll tell you guys. I just got out of that appointment. So do you want? Do you mind holding? I don't mind. It's all. No, I'll take it. We're so funny. She's holding it for me. Um, we're, we just had. We were just sitting on the water. We were thirsty and hungry, so we're just sitting by the water. Um, so for my skin, I had an appointment. They were telling me about the, the peel options or micro needling. Do you guys know I do like my microderma roller at home, but like this one's like a more intense version. It's so expensive, but like I'm contemplating. So I don't know. I'll let you guys know what I decided to do. Either way, I'm thinking about getting off my medication. I'm gonna talk to my dermatologist. We'll see. So I'm gonna go home and get ready, and I'm gonna be getting um, dinner later with Lily and her beau. Tommy. Tommy. I'm vegan. I get to meet my best friend's boyfriend tonight. What do vegans eat? Can somebody Google that for me? I think they eat a lot of like tofu, right, and soy. So every day when I get up in the morning, I'm like, hey, what way am I gonna cook well, my tofu today? Yeah, it's kind of tricky. I what think, are your options? I want to say they have vegan, like fake eggs. Even like healthy stuff, they can't. Like I'm gonna have like granola and yogurt later. Like you can't even. Well, have I think yogurt. the bottom line is there's vegan kinds of all that stuff. Like there's vegan yogurt, vegan meats, vegan. Okay, so there's a special store. Yeah, I think they just buy like specifically. Yeah. Wow. Whatever floats your boat. It's yeah, Alright guys, I just got back home. Um, you guys, I always have a hard time finding a place to put you in the kitchen. But I feel like it's a pretty good spot. You're in my cabinet. I'm so oily right now. I don't know if it's oil or sweat. But uh, it's there and it's shiny. We're not shine free 2003 right now, boo boo. I'm so parched. Parched. Drinking my hint water. When are y'all gonna sponsor me? <laughs> Just got home. It is four o'clock. Um, and now I'm just gonna get ready and hang out for a bit before I go out with Tommy and Lily later. So I thought I would open, I got a couple of packages in. Do I remember what I ordered from Amazon? No. Do I ever remember what I ordered from Amazon? No. So um, these sunglasses are uh, so cute. These are Steve Madden. I got them at TJ Maxx. I love my Dizzy Perkins Key huge aviators, but I felt like this outfit was a little more dainty. More dainty. All right, so. Oh, I think I might remember what's in here, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. I am so excited about this. I ordered, um, activated coconut charcoal powder that teeth whitening powder i have seen i don't know we'll have to we'll have to do a whole video on this and see if it's really um what people think because i have heard so many good things about this oh my god it's like charcoaly some of it's coming out so if you guys have not seen this stuff on the internet it's literal like ground up charcoal powder and it's supposed to be like an incredible incredible teeth whitener like after two uses your teeth go from like yellow to like white so i'm really curious if it's just a hoax or not um, i'll do it in a separate video so this is called active wow that's the brand i got it on amazon it had a lot of really good reviews so okay directions use a soft toothbrush dampen the brush dip it in the powder gently brush your teeth for one to two minutes rinse thoroughly use once or twice daily um, enjoy a whiter healthier smile or the natural smile <laughs> the natural way so I really hope it works. I'm so excited about it. There's something else here. Oh, this, this, <laughs> if you guys follow me um, on Twitter, I was asking you guys, where could I get, you know how like those really big fishnet tights are in right now to wear like under high-waisted things, like the one with the really big holes? I've seen like a bunch of them, but I could never find them for plus size. So I uh, thought I would ask you guys and one of you guys found it on Amazon so here they are these are so trendy right now and I have these really baggy boyfriend jeans with really big holes and they would look so cute under it so hmm this is from costume adventure and the brand is be wicked and they are plus size fishnet stockings so I'll let you guys know how they are hopefully they're um, actually like high-waisted and stuff and have another 
really big package from Garnier Fructis. Uh, and I've never gotten stuff from them before, so this is like a really big box. Like, what are this? What's in here? I'm like so fascinated why this box is so big. Bubble wrap. Ooh, we're gonna have fun with this later. Hey, Garnier girl. Summer's just around the corner. It's so to stock you up with all your getaway essentials. <gasps> Honey. Oh, this is so cute. So, we have a big, this is great. I'm going to the beach tomorrow with my mom. Um, oh, I think there's like a beach bag. It says vacation on it. We have a Garnier beach towel. Um, ooh, I didn't know Garnier had, um, Moisture Bomb sheet masks. This, I, are, I buy this all the time. This is my favorite micellar water. This is a really good one from Garnier. I'm obsessed. Ooh, I'm so excited they have sheet masks. So we have a Moisture Bomb. Wait, I think they have different things in them. Pomegranate extract and hyaluronic acid. That's good for hydration. Then we have um, green tea with hyaluronic acid for normal to combination skin. And then we have, for dry and sensitive skin, chamomile and hyaluronic acid. Nice! We have a little sleek and shine. Frizz Guard Anti-Frizz Dry Spray. And Micellar Makeup Removing Towelettes. Slay me! Thank you so much, Garnier. Oh, that was probably really loud, sorry. Oh my god, awesome. And this beach bag is so damn cute. Stop it. <gasps> Look how cute this is. It's like, got a really firm bottom. Vacation, this is really cute. I'm actually probably gonna get a lot of use out of this bag. Um, so that's all. The next time you see me, I will be snatched. I say that all the time. Like whenever I'm vlogging, I'm always like, the next time you see me, this face is gonna be snatched. Hello friends, see I told you I would be snatched the next time you saw me, hello. I am snatched, hello. Um, so I used my hair crimper. My hair is so dirty right now. Y'all don't even know, <laughs> y'all don't even know. Um, <laughs> is it bad that I like, I'm not ashamed to tell you that? Um, dry shampoo is magical. <laughs> so let me show you my outfit, which I am really enjoying. Um, I love this top so much. This is um from Primark. I like it because it kind of cinches it a little, gives you like a little bit of waist. It's a little big, but it's still super cute. I have my strapless bra on from Torrid. Love this strapless bra, it's so good. I also have, oh my God, I'm wearing Torrid leggings as well. I mean, jeggings, um, my favorite. And then I'm wearing, oh my God, Torrid shoes. <gasps> Oh my god, I didn't even realize I was wearing so much Torrid. Um, but um, I had posted an Instagram, and everyone is already asking for a hair tutorial. <laughs> so I will definitely get on that soon. Like, nice voluminous waves. So, I'm wearing MAC Velvet Teddy like I do. I had on a berry lip in my Instagram post, if you're wondering. It was called um, Bold Berry from e.l.f. I had it on, but then it felt like a little too much, and I'm going to get Mexican with them. And it's probably gonna get a little messy, <laughs> so it's easier to reapply nude. I went a little bit smokier on the eye tonight. Actually really feeling my look, feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. Okay, bye. Good morning, everyone. I just, I don't even know. I haven't really done my hair yet. Probably won't even do it because I'm going to the beach today right now. It's very early, hence my morning voice. But my mom and I are about to head over to the beach because it is gonna be 85 and sunny today. Yes, tomorrow's gonna be 90 and sunny. So we thought we would go to the beach and just lay in our beach chairs for a bit. So um, <laughs> I didn't wrap up the vlog last night, I was so tired. So I thought I'd come on and say goodbye. Um, and I would let you know, it's gonna be like, let's do a beach essentials, but it's so early in the season, I don't even really know. All I know is I have some prescription sunglasses because your girl's blind. <laughs> I'm wearing that distressed um, little terry cloth dress from Forever 21 Plus, so I'm just wearing it as a beach cover-up. So anyway, have a great day. I love you. See you next time.